the, the, the most enjoyable things about this whole event is that it's free and uh -huh. everything is provided for the artist, the chalk, and um, just to recreate something and just the joy of putting marks on a paper. All right. Let me uh. Let me finish this while I still got this. All right. The goal will move right along. It's it's very difficult because I feel like I have more inside of me than I can put on the street. Uh huh. But um, I have to remember it's just street. It's not like gonna. It's not for posterity. Uh huh. It's just for a couple days. Yeah. Yeah. So for them to be able to see something evolve um, in front of in front of their eyes is always an interesting thing. I can't sing. Or I'd be over there. Uh huh. I I do have um, a need to do something creative. It just when it turns out, it's really nice. If it doesn't turn out, it's uh -huh. You know, frustrating, you just throw it away. It's the night. My, someone tells me it's just paper. Uh -huh. paper. This is, this is just the street. I hope there'll be a third one. It would be, I think it would be a very neat thing to have happen at an event like this. And, uh -huh. and the more um, involvement, I mean, there's... A lot of the younger kids are enjoying just doing, and the parents are with them. It's sort of neat to see, you know, they're outlining each other on the pavement, painting themselves. There's a children's section behind us. Yep. And um, I think it would be it would be a nice nice feature for the town because um, I promoted um, getting folks to participate and so on. And as word gets oh, out, there is a lot of who've come by today just saying if we do it next year, definitely you know keep their name on tap. So. Mm -hmm. As with every venture, you know, it, it grows slow and then it progresses into something that's really sort of a trademark of the area.